What is alopecia? And here I'm specifically referring to alopecia areata. I'm Dr. Robert Haber. Alopecia just means hair loss, and there are many kinds of hair loss. But alopecia areata has been in the news a lot recently, particularly after the Academy Awards ceremony where Will Smith reacted violently to a joke by Chris Rock that referenced Jada Pinkett Smith's hair. Jada states she suffers from alopecia areata, so lots of people are looking for information on that condition. Hair loss specialists like myself treat this condition every day, as it's quite common and can present at any age from infancy to the elderly. Alopecia areata is an autoimmune disorder in which the body's immune system attacks its own hair follicles. It generally presents as small, completely hairless patches of skin on the scalp, but sometimes those patches enlarge and all the hair on the scalp, and in fact, all the hair on the entire body can be lost. Treatment most often begins with injections of steroids, and I've helped grow back entire heads of hair with this method. Alternatively, we sometimes rely on powerful topical medications to try to achieve the same result. And in June of 2022, the FDA approved the first ever drug specifically for the treatment of severe alopecia areata. Illumian is a type of drug known as a JAK inhibitor based on its molecular mechanism of action. And while it's not known why it works for this condition, the results can be dramatic. Illumian is taken orally as a pill, and as is always true with systemic treatments, there are potential side effects. If you are suffering from alopecia areata, you should be under the care of a dermatologist skilled in the management of hair loss. Treatment options and potential side effects will be discussed and hopefully your hair will grow back. And if our office in Beechwood, Ohio is convenient for you, I'd be delighted to care for you myself.